What's up, everybody? Badass here with another Starfield video. And in this video, we're just going to continue on with our quest. Probably going to do some more Vanguard uh, missions. I really thought the last uh, mission was pretty cool with the uh, the Xeno uh, warfare and all that kind of stuff. So, But anyway, if you all enjoy the video, please drop a like. And remember, if you want more, if any more, subscribe. Let's get into this. So this is the mission we're going to be doing. Delivering devils. We need to um, find Percival Walker on Mars. Um, and uh, da -da -da, let's see, Percival is recently working with the Trade Authority there, so that seems like a natural place to check first. Okay, cool. So I guess he's missing. Colleague of um, the girl we were working with before. That's pretty cool. Was uh, spacesuit to be honest with you. You're sick. Percival, that name sounds familiar. I don't know why. Let's see what we got. Go this way. There we go. Is this Percival? No. Invoices can be collected from the... Oh. Not here for a delivery, are you? No. Do you now? Well, I do wish I could help you, Captain, but Dr. Walker has been missing for some time. A shame, too. We had such high hopes for Percival. I brought him on myself to do medical and biological consulting around the city. Not the sort of work the Trade Authority traditionally does, but we thought it had the potential to become a whole new type of revenue stream for our branch. I invested right. no small amount of personal capital into the endeavor. But then he decided to run off after a discipline issue. I presume the miners have him hidden somewhere. Plenty of cracks on this old rock. But at this point, it's probably for the best. They were all devils. Red Devils, a UC Marine unit oh, based okay. here on Mars, though they were disbanded shortly after the Colony War. I presume a number of them served alongside Dr. Walker. Bonds forged in battle and all that. I think we may have met this guy already. Let's see. That's correct. We're no longer interested in Dr. Walker's services. He did leave his post, however, with a sizable debt to his name. If you were to find him and get him to pay, the Trade Authority would be most grateful for it. Just this one time? I am all too aware that once one starts doing favors for the Trade Authority, it can be difficult to stop. Okay. Why? Feeling charitable? I don't recall the exact figure off the top of my head, but with the interest it's accrued, I believe it's something substantial. So if you were able to find him and convince him to clear his accounts, you would have our honest gratitude. Wow. That pays the bills. Yes. Not everything needs to be a transaction. I agree. Hmm. Pity. Perhaps a little advance on my part might pique your interest. Visit the Sixth Circle, a bar on the lowest level of the city. If someone in Sidonia knows where Percival is, you'll find them there. Where's my advance? A reminder that particle detonations can occur beyond the city advance. limits Whatever. between the hours of 0600 yeah, and 1800 local time. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Come on, Dreja. P2. Oh, my bad. I didn't ask for her permission to say her name incorrectly. It's her different. <clears throat> well, I'm still shocked over. about Governor Hurst. Broken Spears upstairs. Go drown yourself there. This bar is for devil's vets and their kin.
Doc Walker? Well, you're barking up the wrong... Andy, you. Why don't you come here and tell me what some vanguard captain wants with Walker? The red eyes are some badge of honor, I take it? They would be difficult to conceal. Oh, yeah, so she's got the red eyes too. The other girl that we helped, uh, ah, the, um, what's her name? I forget her name. Except with the H. The girl we helped, uh, with the alien. She had red eyes too. She must be part of the, like, these red devils or whatever. Stray topsider wanders into my bar asking after a man like Percival Walker. Raises questions. What do you want with him? Hadrian. Hadrian. A woman named right. Hadrian sent you, a member of the Vanguard, to find Percival. I think it's her in the background, huh? Is that her in the now background? If that tag's a forgery. Could it's be. a damn good one. All right, Captain. If you are who you say, Supra et Ultra. Vanguard motto. What's it mean? Oh, I know what it means. Should have gotten that during your oath. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Hmm, I see. And tell me, what grade was it you got on your entrance exam? Oh, a, I don't remember them telling, C, telling us. D plus. That is right. All right, Captain. Maybe you are who you say you are. But look, even if I decided I was going to help you get in contact with Dr. Walker, Percival made himself scarce for a reason. Mm -hmm. His debt to the Trade Authority. But if someone resolved that debt, well, Percival wouldn't have to hide anymore. Can bet that person would make a friend out of Percival. And the rest of us devils. Okay. That might be I'm interesting. I'm always inclined to help a friend. Well, most straightforward way to take care of this debt would be to just saunter up to the authority and pay him direct. If you've got credits to throw away. Nope. Of course, rumor is the trade authority keeps all their records and collection now we're talking. files on a central server inside their storeroom. If someone was to break in there and mm -hmm. adjust Percival's mm -hmm. debt to something a little more reasonable, okay. say, a few hundred credits, I'd be happy to cover the costs. Crossing the Trade Authority could be perilous. There are real stakes here. But uh, one friend of Hadrian's to another, Sidonia's full of old utility spaces. Wouldn't be surprised if there was one that let out okay. right into the authority storeroom. Say, with an entrance behind the bar at the Broken Spear. Ooh, and you might need these. <laughs> okay. Red Devils were the meanest marine unit the UC Navy ever had. Couldn't get in if you hadn't done at least one stint as a Martian Dusty. Made us tough. Reliable. It's why they chose us as the handlers for the UC Xeno weapons. No other unit could handle that pressure. Percival, though, he wasn't a grunt like all of us. Science officer. Made sure the monsters behaved themselves around the devils. And didn't with everyone else. But it was those monsters that did us in. When the colony war ended and the armistice came down, everything associated with Xeno weapons got shelved, Red Devils included. Now, yeah, now they're just a memory. Me, nah, infantry officer, but my grunts deployed alongside the things. Never seen anything like it, before or since. Monsters from the darkest corners of the black rampaging across the battlefield. And understand why they banned them. Brutal. Armistice hurt us more than most, but... Wow. Wasn't all bad that came out of that agreement. 
and I look forward to hearing the good news. Yep, we'll get it taken care of, no problem. Hey, you may be Hadrian's friend. Come here. Yeah. Heard you talking with Lou, so you're going to help Dr. Walker? Oh, good, good. Oh, Percival's a good guy. Listen, I know how you can do it without having to resort to any... B and E. Aqueous okay. hematite. Mars is full of it. People think it's just garbage. But Percival and I, we've been working on some projects in the deep mines. Okay. At least when he wasn't slaving away at his trade authority contract. But we stumbled on a way to make it useful and profitable. Hmm. You give our research over to Octai at the trade authority, it should more than cover Percival's debt. That guy's always looking for an angle. Well, yeah. We were never able to finish the research. Spacers moved in and ran us out. Started setting up shop. Oh, I know what comes next. But if you can clear them out, I can walk you through how to finish the research. Then you can give it over to the Trade Authority. Hmm. They'll get folks working in the deep mines again. Jobs come back, I become a modern-day folk hero. <laughs> then I don't have to sleep on an inflated spacesuit anymore. biggest employer on Mars has always been Demo Star Yards. After the Colony War, Armistice meant they needed a lot fewer warships. Fewer ships meant fewer minerals. That meant a lot of folks scrounging for work around here. Hmm. Kind of interested in sneaking in and changing the dead amount. But. Oh, hey! You change your mind about clearing out those spacers, finishing our research, help a guy stop having to sleep on an inflated spacesuit? Hmm. Four, three. Uh, a bunch of parasites and cutthroats. They're folks from the fringes of space, willing to put down anyone who tries to move in on what they've decided is theirs, gotcha. even when it ain't. Strange like Raiders, this group would pick probably. Mars as a new home. Sure, we're not downtown New Atlantis, but there are places where they'd be bothered less than here. My guess is the authority tipped them off when they heard we were working down there. And cut off what they thought was the competition, you know? Huh. So we take these guys out, provide a new provide new jobs, a new resource. Okay. That might be the way to go, to be honest. Um. Great, great. So access to the deep mines can be found outside the city. It's not far. Shouldn't even need to hop back in your ship. We'd set up right near the main drill. Taking out the spacer leader should get the message across to the rest of them to buzz off. Okay. Once you've managed that, phone up here on the comms panel, and I can walk you through finishing the research. Okay. All right, so we still have the, those options. Let's see what we got here. Pay off the debt. We can kill the spacer leader. Huh. So it sounds like the spacer just kind of moved in. And maybe even killed innocent people off. They probably got to go. All right, let's go ahead and do this one, I guess. All right, let's go. Let's go get him.
that were coming up on the area. Okay. Anybody outside waiting for us? Probably just kind of sneak through, go up on the top there. Anybody over there? Someone sees us. Let's fucking go. That gun is fucking dope. I'm talking about. We're hidden. Probably best to get up on top here. It looks like I have to go through the front. <clears throat> and, um. There's people up in the front we can take them out, like, from the top. What's it got me looking at? Okay. There we go. What I was doing. Didn't seem to be anybody else. Please don't jump in front of me. So I don't want to shoot you in the face. Let's go around this way. So there's someone around. So we got that little bit of green going. Probably seeing her. Dude up on top. You switch to the always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. Open up. Lost them. Yeah. over here nope only a matter of time I hear somebody definitely this is where the front door was I believe yeah you keep running they are right there switch other gun That sneak damage with this gun is pretty dang good. 
serious the game? I can't walk that way. Like, are you kidding me? Ay, ay, ay. I hate to complain, but jeez, man. Only a matter of time. It is. It is. I agree with that shit. Die already! Meet your death. Yeah, she she good. <laughs> Go ahead and get on the side. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Where'd they Take go? Take your best shot. Oh. It says I'm in danger. Where are they at? Definitely hear them. Yeah, the rest of them are probably out, inside. Out. I think they're back there. Oh, maybe that's the door. Okay. Oh, the guy. That's the guy we killed. Scavengies, fuckers. Oh, sweet. Got something, uh, something good there. Oh, okay. okay. That looks like it might be a pretty good gun, actually. Let's go ahead and, uh, bust in here. Oh, you know what? Did we scavenge all the bodies? Not sure. No, we did not. We did not. Of a magnet. I haven't seen that before, so we'll go ahead and grab it. It's a research lab. I really don't need that. Beautiful. Okay, that works. Salmon filet. And shows, stealing, looting, killing. Okay. Oh, we're just getting started. something I'm gonna try to uh, be a bit more thorough with the scavenging I've kind of been a little remain alert best to assume we have not seen the last of these spacers I've been uh, looking through every nook and cranny 
Uh, I don't think we really need that, to be honest. We, need some, we don't need Cabernet or Riesling, woman. important so we'll grab it. Kill pack chicken. Sneak around. Being sneaky in this game looks like it's pretty good actually. Some of a bit more range. running. Hitting them. Maybe not. Okay. Come on. You've been the pain in the neck. Daddy Likey. say that you're running another one of those Xeno things. Best not to leave anything useful behind. We gotta remember where, we, where everyone died. We need to collect all this shit. If we can get out of that danger thing, we can we can actually yeah get get some double double damage hits on people. Sell her. Head. Cowards. It's hard to see where I'm shooting, to be honest. I'm not sure if I'm hitting them or not. Continue here. Ok, 
can't even see this guy. Still hiding. Okay. I don't think we really have anybody else shooting shooting at us. Beautiful. Not that we need it, but that's good to have. Alright, so cheese. Yay. Water and lemon, baby. Only on this channel you get excited about water and lemon. I'll go through these areas a little slow. I'm trying to be more, a bit more stealthy. Um, which I think works in this game, to be honest. What am I hitting? Now I gotta float 12 feet in the air very slowly so everyone can see me. Stick with the suppressed weapons. So let's see, can we even, is there an option to open this door? I did not think so, I just didn't want to keep going and, and not check that. All right. So, so the AI does get in your way a little bit. I understand why they did it, but. Minus quarters ahead, perhaps? Field with more spacers, no doubt. Okay, that's fine. Not overly concerned. Is that creaking or is that them shooting at something? Okay. This guy is fucking awesome. Sweetheart, you gotta stop jumping in front of me. I really don't want to kill you. There you go. Come on. Come on out. I got you. Oh, yes, it is. It's, it is real. Good job. Probably the best campaign I've had so far, to be honest. Good job, Andres. Good job. I'll thank you later. All right. So, let's see. Did they have anything of value? Oh, the cutlass. That's the um, sword. We didn't really need that. Toxins for crafting. So I'm hearing some. Obviously, you probably hear it too. But I'm hearing a lot of activities. We need to kind of go up there. I think that's where we killed some of these guys. Guys and gals, I don't want to be. I include everyone in my killing. Uh, let's see. Whatever we can let Red Dull, we don't need that. Lamb. Got that. kind of keep pressing forward. I just don't want to really miss anything. See? Oh, miss that. I've been here. 
to. Okay. I got myself turned around here. I think we're the right way. Okay. I'm hearing some moaning and some groaning. I wonder if that's the mines or if there's another alien around. Hey, bitch. Did Andresia throw that? Or? Not remain so. in the back might be a suitable alternative. So how do we get here? There's caves in the back. This is what she's referring to? I think it's what she's referring to. Moving. <laughs> Looks like the, our guy we need is here. So I'm on fire. Gotta keep an eye on our health, because that's something that... Give up already. Is that Andresia saying that? <laughs> all over the place out of here. She's about to get shot up. Beautiful. That's some good shit. I didn't see what it said. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I gotta contact them. Okay, cool. The comms panel. Okay, let's get down here. There we go. Hello? Oh, took care of the spacers, huh? Look good. Now to finish off the research, you're gonna need to collect a sample of the hematite to run through the pressure. Grab a laser cutter and head back to the chamber where you came in. Once you've got a sample, pressure's the big machine in the next room. Costco to start it is Ares 2330. Okay. Take care of all that, and we'll have Percival's name cleared in no time. Sweet. <clears throat> Let's get him cleared. Collect a uh, blah blah sample. Okay. This one to go collect the sample. Awesome. Fit the deposit in the thresher. Okay, cool. And what was what did it say? Optional? What was the optional? Hold on. I just don't want to miss something here. Deposit. Okay, cool. We're still in the optional portion. We're good. We're good. Cool. Alright. Password accepted. Initiating analysis. Probably down here. That's probably where it is. Okay. You too. Okay. If he's still in the bar, I think this is the way to go. Sweet. Sidonia can have a depressing effect on yep, there we go. You've got the slate. Let me see. Reduce joint wear? Oh, increase lifting capacity. A dose of this stuff could make a binder way more efficient. Oh, heck yeah. This formula's got to be worth at least as much as whatever Percival owes. Okay, so here's what you do. Tell Octai and the Trade Authority you found a business proposal that will make miners more efficient, higher yield, synergy, you know, all that business crap. Cool. And that you'll trade it to him for clearing Percival's debt. You good at doing pitches and stuff like that? Yeah, that's what I live for. You can try if you feel confident, but I didn't want to push our luck. Besides, if that drug gets big, I think everyone benefits. Okay. So, you think you can sell them on it? Yes. Oh, this is gonna be great. Oh, and here, a copy of the formula for yourself, in case you ever want to oh, try maximizing your Little own recipe out of it. output. Oh, use Works. that if you can. Good luck. Was there something else? Hmm. I'm never one to turn away an opportunity. But I'd be curious what you think you've uncovered in the Martian market that others have missed.
Aqueous hematite, iron and wastewater. Well, I'm not surprised no one has proposed something like this before. And exactly what does this new drug of yours do? Hmm. An interesting proposal, if your data pans out. But where's this hematite coming from? The active mines would be too expensive to retool. The deep mines could be an option, but they're full of spacers. Or so I've heard. Is... Is that so? Well now, that is intriguing. A completely untapped resource pool, and the sort of utility every mining firm in Sidonia would be clamoring to get their hands on. <coughs> we could contract out all the actual lab work, bring on one of the hungrier mining concerns for materials, the licensing fees alone, and think what it would do for our image with the general populace. This mine reopened thanks to the Martian Trade Authority. Very interesting indeed. And what do you want for the rights to this drug? Dr. Walker's dead? That's it? Consider it wiped. Well, it seems we have a deal then. And here. A finder's fee from the Authority. A perfectly reasonable amount for a discovery with this sort of potential. Wouldn't want you feeling short-changed down the road. We'll just be taking that slate before you have any second thoughts. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Captain. Probably should have taken the credits and then paid it off, but whatever. Did you now? Fine work. My end of the bargain then, I suppose. He's holed up in the old Red Devils HQ. Place was sealed up tight after the UC shuttered our unit. But we snuck him in the back entrance through the deep mines. Okay. Was also going to warn you about spaces down there. But it sounds like you might have already tossed those dregs. Here. The passkey. I'll let him know there's someone he owes one hell of a thank you on their way down. Beautiful. Okay. I think we collected the stuff, didn't we? Okay, cool. Find him. Uh, I don't know if this is the way to go. Okay. Interesting. Okay, maybe, maybe this is the way to go. Let's see. this so where do 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 so I'm gonna kind of try to follow it on the map here but oh there's a door right here cool beautiful almost looks like a vault huh 
Let's see, is there another door? See what's over here. Well, let's continue on our mission here. I'm trying to uh, scavenge and explore more, but I don't want to. Uh, too much time doing that. Too difficult. Okay. I was hitting the uh, wires. <laughs> okay. Let's keep on moving. Not really curious for that. You can always come back for that. Even though you probably won't. <clears throat> Let's get in the first person here. We're pretty close. I can't say I don't appreciate it, but I doubt you came all this way just to do me a favor. Now you want to explain to me why you're going around harassing nefarious old men by wiping away their hard-earned debts? Adrian sent you. She's... did... did she look okay? Sounds like Adrian. Watch that woman lose a digit trying to get a better tissue sample. <clears throat> what? You can reattach a finger, per se. So what exactly did she have you bring me? Bam. Terramorph attack, huh? Not exactly sure why you'd be bringing that... Wait, Tal Gourmet? Like, Tal Seti Tal Gourmet? That's a joke, right? There's no settlement old enough on Tau Ceti to have a Terramorph. Either someone's setting up the worst petting zoo in the universe, or if she made you come all the way for this. Let's get inside. I need to see these cells. Okay. Let's see what he's got. Gonna ask you to not touch anything. Got some projects in the works down here. And I wasn't expecting guests. And there's probably something good here to take. Oh, and Lou mentioned how you took care of the dead. Can't say I'm thrilled the trade authority got this mess on me recently. But I guess that's right. Damn, there we go. Alright, so. This... 
This can't be right. This sample, it's Londinian. I'll... I'll need to get this all in a slate. Adrian really gave you this sample. You're not lying to me? Because if you told me this was a hoax, and it'd be the best damn fake I've ever seen, I'd be mad and very, very relieved. Can't just humor an old man, huh? This sample, it's got all the indicators of the worst terramorph attack in human history. Oh, shit. I presume you've heard of Londinian. It was a city wiped completely off the map by terramorphs. The swarms are so bad, they had to blow the spaceport and seal the place off from the galaxy at large. Not a lot of samples made it off the world from the time of the attack, but the ones that did, well, they look just like this one. I didn't detect any of the telltale signatures this specimen ever sat on a ship while it was alive, either. I don't think it was transported to Talzetti. This specimen, it grew there. Faster than any Terramorph should. Which means, if we're about to start a new era in human Terramorph relations, where big, sudden Londinian-style attacks can happen outside Londinian, that's not gonna end well for humanity. The chances for survival, let alone maintaining any kind of functioning society, would be slim indeed. So you lugged this bad omen all the way here. You want to tell me what your plans are for it now? The circle, huh? Could use a drink about now. Here, faster we take the lift to the surface. Not supposed to use it, but given the circumstances, I'm inclined to just ask forgiveness. Let's get going. So it's definitely starting to get interesting. I really like the kind of aliens-esque kind of uh, vibe I'm getting with this. Let's go so. It's all the way over there. Let's go ahead and see if we can fast travel over there. Okay. Travel. Let's go. Getting interesting. Definitely getting interesting. Good old P2. Is, is that really her? Hadrian. Percival. My God, look at you. You're an old man now. <laughs> you know, hassling yourself anymore, Major. Our friend here showed me your sample. Suffice it to say. Not here. Let's talk somewhere more private. Lou said we could use the back. Did he? Lou gave me the abridged version of what went down. Yeah, I can't thank you enough for taking care of all that. Makes two of us. I hope it ultimately didn't end up being too much trouble. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just glad you both came through it intact. So, were you two able to get that work up together? Got it right here. That sample? It's an exact match for the ones from Londinian. Londinian. That's... that's exactly what I was afraid of. 
Not thrilled to be the bearer of that kind of news. That's for damn sure. So tell me you've got some kind of plan for that workup. Well, right now, we've got more questions than answers. So I've been trying to figure out what it's going to take to access our old Terramorph data. Good place to start. What'd you find? It's in the archives. The Armistice Archives? Doesn't that mean we'd be dealing with the Cabinet? And the Freestar Collective? And House Varun somehow? Guess we can kiss that approach goodbye. I didn't think the Cabinet would be willing to hear us out either. But I called in some favors. They've agreed to hear us out on two conditions. One, they want to see this analysis you two have procured. And two, they want to discuss what happened on Tau Ceti. With both of us. Of course. You deserve the full story. Percival and I, we're not just researchers. We were military scientists, ran a division of the UC together that deployed aliens on the battlefield as weapons. Place I was hiding out. That was our unit's home base. After some early fits and starts at other facilities, the place eventually became the heart of UC Xeno warfare. A practice that's been banned ever since the Armistice went into effect almost 20 years ago. And the UC military cut us loose for what we'd done. Oh. Well... That, um... That means a lot. It's not something I'm exactly proud of. But it was during that assignment that the UC asked us to explore deploying Terramorphs on the battlefield. The project never they got were just doing ground, what they were told. But the data our team gathered is now sitting in the archives, along with all the other information banned after the Colony War. Under the watchful eye of monitors from all the galactic factions still participating in regular politics. But if we can convince the Cabinet to help us access that data, it'll give us the tools we need to decipher what exactly this sample might mean. And hopefully, how to prevent more attacks like the one that spawned it. I mean, I hope they will. But accessing the archives, it's not 100% up to them. They'll also need the consent of the other signatories of the Colony War Armistice, the Freestar Collective and House Varun, in order to unlock it. Since neither group is exactly on great terms with the UC at the moment, for various reasons. Exactly. It's going to mean negotiations and deals and plenty of diplomatic legwork to see this through. But I don't see a better option to solving what's going on here. So it's going to be up to us to get them on board. All right. I'm gonna go get this work up into the Cabinet's hands. I'll meet you out front of Mast in New Atlantis. Good luck. You two are gonna need it. What is it? Awesome. Well, it sounds like we've got some negotiating to do. Cool. Well, another cool uh, adventure, another awesome quest. Um, with all the other options out there, I greatly appreciate you guys stopping by, and um, I'll see you on the next one. Late.